Well, that rain's not going anywhere today. We're going to be seeing high temperatures in the mid to upper 50s. Some of us could get into the 60s if that low pressure system turning off in the Gulf moves a little bit further north. We could see some warm air being kind of brought into some of our more southern southerly counties. So if you're if you're uh, south of I-20, there's a chance you could see some temperatures into the lower 60s today, but for the majority of us mid to upper 50s with rain throughout the day today. Let me time that out for you. We've already seen a good bit of rain, but as we're coming into the uh, morning hours as you're going off to work, that's when the majority of that heavy rain will be moving through. By lunchtime, we'll be tapering off to just showers, but still could hear a rumble of thunder here and there moving throughout the uh, early at least the early part of the afternoon, but those showers do become more and more sparse moving towards the evening hours. You shouldn't have to uproot any plans over Friday night, but as you're coming in, don't be surprised if you do see another little spot shower or two here and there really just kind of wrap up all this that we've been seeing here earlier today. Moving on Friday into Friday evening, though, that rain does move out and even on into Saturday, that rain does move out. But we'll still see clouds throughout Saturday as well, as well as patchy as well as fog on Saturday morning. Some of it could be patchy. Some of it could be locally dense, reducing visibility at down to as much as a quarter of a mile or less than that. So definitely take your time if you're getting out anywhere Saturday morning. That fog will could last until the late morning on Sunday with that sun coming up to really bust it up about 9 or 10 a.m. Rainfall totals for today range anywhere between a quarter of an inch to a half an inch, maybe a little bit more or less, depending on how heavy that rain is. I know we've had some really locally heavy rains at times, but anywhere between a quarter of an inch to a half an inch for most of us, and that'll linger on through the rest of the day today. Take a look ahead, though. You'll see temperatures do rise as we move through the rest of move into and through the rest of our weekend and into the start of next work week. We'll be in the 70s for Saturday with that fog in the morning going to partly sunny conditions by the afternoon. We're in the mid 70s for Sunday and Monday. Monday, sunny on Sunday with rain returning in the evening hours of Sunday and by Monday rain and thunderstorms return, but I'll have more on that as we get there.